I'm Jeff Arms. And I'm Maria Arms. And I am the president and founder of Archon Data. And I'm the senior vice president of Archon Data. We are a software company that's focused on uh, oil and gas asset management, and we manage uh, tubular assets, uh, pipe and steel, uh, and other types of equipment uh, for the oil and gas industry globally. Uh, currently, we have operations in Canada, Great Britain, Egypt, Saudi Arabia, and throughout the United States. Scotland. Scotland. We got our start many years ago when I developed a very, very simple application uh, to manage uh, pipe. Um, I kind of put that on the back burner as I went uh, throughout my growing throughout my career working on larger enterprise projects. Um, and then a couple of years ago we decided to uh, form a company around this simple little product which is now uh, the elite in software uh, for the oil and gas industry an out-of-the-box solution to do things that most of the oil and gas industry is still using paper to do today. The challenge with uh, asset management for the oil and gas industry is that uh, assets don't come through your typical supply chain. Uh, they uh, are cyclical in nature, um, which means they come in and out. Uh, they require maintenance. Uh, their long-term long assets require um, significant maintenance, uh, government compliance. Um, they are very expensive, hard to track, and our software allows them to do all of that in one package uh, with very little training. Uh, we can take uh, uh, the, the simplest, uh, you know, the, the most technical, technically challenged, uh, you know, oil field worker and train them to use our software in less than an hour. And uh, th then that information is, uh, you know, is pulled from throughout the organization up to the corporate C-level so they can make real-time decisions and, uh, and do things that uh, they never dreamed possible uh, with managing their assets and, and staying accountable uh, with, uh, you know, for government and regulatory compliance. In 2011, uh, we took our application to the cloud. So now we actually can connect all the different locations for a company um, in just a, a flash. Through the, uh, using the cloud technology. So now um, all of the locations globally for a company can see the same things real time. Regulatory compliance documentation, the types of assets they have available to them uh, without the cost and infrastructure. So we bumped it up a notch uh, even from our great application. Now it's uh, easy to deploy. One of the big challenges that the oil and gas industry has faced is that uh, most of your software products are designed for a single company. Uh, they're to be used internally by internal employees. Uh, I, you know, with with some prior experience in the oil and gas industry, I understood that it's not the way the oil and gas industry works. Uh, most of their assets are actually managed, maintained by third-party companies. So what we've done is we've developed an application that makes it very profitable for the third-party companies to use for their own profitability, yet we're able to pull all that information together for the larger enterprise and larger global companies so they can see what's located at all of their vendors, all of their contractors, real-time, however, not but not putting an undue burden on their vendors and their contractors by requiring the, them to use software that's not helpful to them. And we call that, uh, our software is called Oil Country OS, and our global, uh, or the, the larger product is called Global View that allows the oil and gas producers to see their assets real time in their third party locations. So there's twofold, it's two parts. Well, our cloud platform allows our software, because we're cloud-based, our software is easily scalable from the smallest company with one user uh, to the largest companies uh, in the world. Um, you know, we manage uh, all of the drill pipe uh, throughout the Middle East for the largest drilling company in the world. And we do that and can scale out to their needs almost instantaneously because of the way we designed our cloud platform. Uh, it makes it very feasible uh, to go to uh, provide an enterprise scale application uh, from everywhere from the very smallest company to the very largest company and allows them to grow their use of the product as quickly or as slowly as they choose to. And their ROI is almost instantaneous because they don't have to deploy a 
comprehensive network that can run it from Starbucks coffee shop. Uh, and since uh, you know the disconnected nature of the oil and gas community, uh, who wants to maintain a network uh, that's that hectic? Um, so we allow them to leverage uh, all of the existing networks in, in the world uh, to manage all of their assets regardless of where they are located globally. One of the things that our customers love about our company, uh, it's not just a software company that we deploy our software, get you trained and use it and walk away. Uh, the beautiful thing about the cloud is we're also your database managers, we're your security managers. Um, and we, we do backups of the data so that it's secure and safe um, versus being in a closet someplace or under somebody's desk. Uh, uh, we're always there to manage in, in case they, they need assistance with their databases. We're there as almost a, a third party internal team that works for them. Uh, we also offer business consulting. So a lot of the companies that we go into, they've never had a software that managed their, their goods, their uh, assets. So we walk in and um, help them with their workflow processes. Um, and uh, we consult with them to make sure that they're not, uh, there's no redundancy or errors and places to lose profits. Many people would ask us an asset management system. It's just an accounting system. No, ours goes far beyond accounting. Our, ours, ours deals with you know, government compliance, uh, regu environmental regulations, uh, many other issues that accounting systems are never going to touch. And the, the challenge for the oil and gas companies is that they have to care, you know, they have to track all of this information related to their assets, where they're located, uh, how much they have, uh, what it's been used for in the past, where it's going, um, what state it's in, whether or not it's usable at that moment or if it needs another inspection, a repair history. And a lot of this information uh, currently throughout the world in largest companies in the world are tracking most of this information either on spreadsheets or in pay, on, on legal pads. And it creates a huge challenge for them to keep track of the history, uh, to keep track of that information. And if they have employee turnover, it hurts their operation until that employee figures out where everything is located again. With our system, it eliminates all of that almost instantly. Uh, so they, so you know, largest company in the world could come to us and say, "Can you begin? You know, uh, can we use your software to manage all of our drill pipe throughout North America?" And we'll say, "Yes." They'll ask us when they can deploy, and instead of giving them a typical answer the software company would give them, which is, "Oh, we can develop it in six to eight months, uh, and then we'll do testing for four months," we say, "We can deploy it today." and your operation can not begin moving forward tomorrow. And we have proven that time and time again that we do deliver on that promise. The BDC has been pivotal in our success to date. Uh, the BDC has brought us uh, many resources uh, and, you know, and much more than just office space, uh, but it's, it's brought us uh, some very good uh, you know, committee members uh, to ask questions to. Uh, it's connected us with our community much better, um, the business community. Uh, it, it allows us to uh, use the BDC resources and get you know, advice. As an entrepreneur and you know, building a startup company, uh, I, am a, I am a software engineer. I'm not a businessman. And the BDC has allowed me to take my great skills that I have as a software engineer and learn how to be a businessman and has given us those resources that we would have never been able to afford uh, you know, as a small startup company. Uh, so, you know, legal services, um, you know, office space, uh, you know, telephone services, and those things has allowed us uh, to reach profitability much quicker uh, and begin empl in, hiring employees from the local community. And as a software technology firm, uh, we are hiring very highly paid employees uh, you know, here in the local market. Uh, they live in South Oklahoma City and more. You know, so uh, it, you know, it's, it's great for our community and it's, a, it's definitely a way that you know, Archon Data can give back in continuing to grow and the BDC has allowed us to do that. 
someone nominated me for Innovator of the Year. And uh, it, it, it made me feel very proud to uh, even be nominated just because as an entrepreneur, we are in the trenches every day. And it's nice to be recognized by someone outside of, outside of what we're doing. All of the effort that we put into, you know, building a strong business uh, to, you know, the time that we dedicate to our employees, uh, the time that we dedicate to our business and, you know, to our, our technologies or whatever our product is. Uh, you know, so it's, it, it's just nice to be recognized uh, by the broader community uh, for the effort that we put in. For the future of Archon Data, it, it helps our employees and it helps me as the entrepreneur know that uh, what we're doing is recognized by more than just my own team. Uh, you know, our, our employees are very proud uh, that we were nominated for Innovative of the Year and uh, you know, it, it gives them uh, more pride in our product, uh, more uh, idea of the vision that we have. Uh, and you know they were very proud that we uh, you know got the nomination